morning we're doing the chakra balancing here at Hella's place. And this little guy, before we even began, already had his head dropped. And I just told the girls they're going to be here as long as he wants. <laughs> so comfort is obviously key for them. But it's really important to read these guys to say that you move on when they're ready. And you see his eyes half closed. He hasn't actually got a halter on. He's not tied in any way. And it's up to him completely as to how his healing session evolves. Hopefully we get to come back to him. Maybe he'll still be here in an hour like this. It's Josephine and I've just pressed the record button as she was thinking of moving them and then she changed her mind. So she's still pretty happy with this hand position. You've got the two people working together on the, the third eye and there on the throat back there. You see the soft eye and the ears will vary, sometimes floppy, sometimes following the hands which will go a little bit further back. If they're sideways, they're floppy. If they're towards the back, she's listening so to that hand position. So our little guy Zeus wanted two people on and it took the team some time to figure out that he wanted Reiki from both, but one at the head and then one uh, moving the hands back here. Now they've figured it out, he's standing like a statue. Now she says that, so look at that for some language, perfect timing. Looked right at Regina, swished his tail and told her it was enough on that particular location. And then you've got to keep watching here, it's kind of neat. Got a little passing gas, so one of the Reiki registers. You've got him alert, but he's still receiving the energy healing really nicely. And there's your horse's whispers. I'm going to try and capture some of these registers on here. And you see this, yes, you'll see eyes shutting, a little bit of a head nod there. You've got the tilt of the pelvis at the top and the relaxed leaf at the bottom here. Just as I wanted to show relaxation, we've actually got this mare asking these guys to move backwards on the chakras. I believe backwards. She stepped back, so maybe she's replacing them, but let's have a quick look and we can monitor as it goes along. So she's asking you to change hand positions. Yeah, usually she'd go forward for them at the rear, but try it, try it. She could just have gone backwards. And so move your hands to the next chakra and see Obviously we have a bit of a head drop, but we're going to keep that line in our hand. When she's uh, afraid, she's walking backwards. She fear. Okay. Oh, yeah. So in this case, chances are it's not going to be fear because uh, she looks very relaxed, but you've got to figure out where to place the hands next. So that, uh, that in particular hand, it, she may not be liking, hence the tail swish and the foot up. But you've got to figure out, because both of you are doing something at the same time, what does she want? So she's, she's certainly communicating with you, Monica, so you're going to move your hand. And you're going to bring the second hand on somewhere. She's putting you at the back. Yeah? She's putting you at the hind. Other sign here, peeing. They don't usually pee during a session, but they often actually pee after a session. Actually, you see content smiles on both of those two. Look, <laughs> we do like to see results like that. Just checking your chakras. Just double check. Regina has had a no on more Reiki, Bant has had a yes, so we're going to check these chakras and see where he's at. And it gives us an indication as to where we should uh, go and we're best served. All of his chakras are open and what we've done is asked him to show us where he'd benefit from the Reiki and this would be pure enjoyment to finish the session. It's the first time I've seen her relax this morning. And you know, on time she come out of it, and that's who she is. She's going to check the environment, and she's going to communicate 
and then soften again and that was a beautiful piece to see as well she'll communicate she'll soften and the art is to read what she's saying about the environment and then read what she's saying about the energy healing as to where she wants the hand see that's her just listening to him back there we don't want to school the horses we want to listen to them and then when she finds her place to relax beautiful moment you get a great yawn a head drop and I'm encouraging individuals to beam with the second hand so that holds space it's a really powerful thing to do is to hold space as you're doing it what we're seeing over here that would be the through and through it's both heart chakra down the bottom and at the top and you could go many ways with this you could go in between the shoulder blades at the front you can go underneath either way it's heart to heart and she split both of her people up to do this we've got one on the head really not surprising because her head's so active her mind's so active and then she's saying to monica perfect timing to either move on or pay attention so sometimes they will want us to be quiet sometimes they say move your hands to a different place And I take it exactly as the girls did there, move your hands to a different place. She's not subtle in the way she asks. When the horses don't say no, it means yes, so when they soften, there's your yes. We're checking the oils with him. That can go in your yes pipe. We're going to go through our oils to see the yeses and the noes. They like to breathe in the smells and they can choose their oils. That's more of a no. See that? He's actually got his nose disgruntled. I want to show that. They're not um, so bold with it but prefers the other one. He's quite subtle with his cues and for us this no is if he actually just smells it and then either turns his head away or doesn't lick and chew. magnify your purpose. <laughs> so he's checking out the girls with the, not just the Reiki, but the oils. So we're coming in a second time with the oils and this is his favorite oil. That's the highest potential. There, he's given you permission to start. Did you feel that? He put his weight on that right leg. So then you step in and continue your session. He's very subtle. You're probably not used to that, Stina. <laughs> she does like that. That's an immune system booster. She, that's one of her favorites so far. She's chasing the bottle down and trying to touch the hand. So we're letting them choose the oils for this Reiki. She's very demonstrative. Nope. See, that was a quick smell and a no. She's trying to find her bottle. <laughs> she, she's going back to her bottle. <laughs> Oh, there's a no on that one. So hopefully we get a pattern. You see there, she smells and she tries to tell you wrong bottle. And she, you have to work fairly quick, see? And she smells and she lets you know. She stays there. No, wrong bottle. And she tries to get the right bottle out of this pack. This mare definitely works quickly. So far we've got two oils she likes. Oh, nope, not the one. That one either. Perfect. 
perfect. I have to show you guys that. See, she stays. I think that's the one. She but likes that one. one as well. And this is our other one that she stayed up with. There's your yeah. favorite. <laughs> There's the favorite. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if you had any doubt on them choosing their oils, which one is it? It is. Uh, Oh, yes. It's I the highest potential, isn't it? No, it's magnify your purpose. Okay. <laughs> she likes that. Got some lovely releases going on with our fellow. Shame I can't capture it all on here, but he really shows where to place hands and where not. And Stina's hands here on this side are really, really hot and sweating underneath. He'd have handprints, but he really expresses in the nostrils. He pulls them up when it's in the wrong place. He's got very soft eyes with it. But what we didn't capture there was when he actually said no, which was very bold. <laughs> right now we're okay. He did need a moment's break. But those eyes, you guys can see that, their eyes are just falling asleep with this Reiki. I say that the door opens over there, but look, you are seeing the eyes half closed and closed. And the sway test showed that he wanted a continuation of all of this. Getting a lot of soft eyes. <coughs> and here we've got the ladies doing double hands back here on the sacral area and on the root. Just going to hurry in so everybody can see it. Really neat. And have you felt anything underneath there? Mm. What have you felt? We have vibrations on the sacral. Do you? I don't know if you guys can hear that, but it's vibrations, and it's really neat when you do the sacral. You can sometimes feel gurgling underneath vibrations. It's fun. Got the bottom lip going here. Now I wanted to show you guys that beautiful sign of relaxation, despite that there's mo motion in the arena. Got great 